can see there. Doing a little crane style Qigong. In this style we walk as we do the Qigong. We use a little footwork similar to Tai Chi. Would you like to learn it? Well, I should find a little space. You don't need this much space. I'm here at Land of Medicine Buddha in Santa Cruz, California. But if you have a little bit of space, join me and let's learn a little walking Qigong. So this is based on the crane. So a lot of Qigong based on animals, and the animals represent psychological qualities. So in this case, the crane represents the energy of your heart, the ability to feel uplifted, expansive, connect more to the sky, to the sun, to the fire element, and thus to improve our spirit, the more ethereal nature of the spirit, connected to air and sun and fire. So what you're gonna do is start with your feet under your shoulders. We always take each step first by turning the toes of one foot out. So we're gonna shift our weight to our left foot. You're gonna lift your right toes. They're gonna to turn a little bit out. And we're gonna shift our weight into the right foot. Bring our left foot forward, just gently touching the heel on the floor. So no weight in it yet. Then you're gonna roll the weight into that foot. And then shift your weight back to the right foot. Lift the left toes, turn them out just a little bit. And then your weight forward into the left foot. Bring the right foot up. You're gonna to touch the heel and then slowly shift the weight. So that's our footwork. On the next one, let's bring in our arms or our wings. Those toes turn out, shift forward. This time as you bring the heel forward, lift your arms up, shoulder height. And as you shift the weight into the front foot, open the wings, bring your chest forward. And then start to shift back. We close the wings. And then weight sinks into the back foot. Your wings come down, lift the front toes. They turn out, shift forward, bring the back heel up, arms up. Open the wings, weight forward into the front leg. Shifting back, close the wings and settle the wings down. Lift those front toes, turn them out. We'll do one more and then we'll learn how to turn around. Touch the heel, open the wings. Close the wings, shift back. This time, keep your wings down by your hips. Lift your front toes. In my case, it's the left foot. Hopefully, it's still yours too. The left toes are gonna turn in towards the right toes. You get pigeon-toed here. Then you're gonna lift your right toes, turn them around. So now we've turned everything around. Now we just wanna get that right foot a little bit to the right. So as we lift the hands, pick up the heel, set it a little bit to the right. Shift the weight forward, open the wings. Close the wings, shift back. We're just going the other direction now. Turn the front toes out, bring the back foot up. And open. Close, sink back. Lift the front toes, turn them out. Let's use our breath, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. So this is great work for balance, great for strengthening the feet, building our coordination, proprioception. But we also want to use it to calm the nervous system and find some spiritual and emotional upliftment. So I feel that sense of lightness in the heart. We're soaring like the crane. See if we can turn this around one more time. Lift the front toes, turn them towards the back. Lift your back toes, turn on the heel. Lift the heel, set a little bit to the side, and then open up. So this is just, that's just to get us off the tight rope. We don't want the feet one behind the other. We want them a little wide and long. Get your balance in that foot super strong before you shift. That's what I mean. You're gonna turn your toes out, shift your weight, make sure your weight is really solid in this leg before you attempt to bring the back foot up. If you're working with a little smaller space, feel free to just take smaller steps. This movement doesn't have to be too big. It can be just, just a tiny bit. Just touch that heel. That can also be good if your knees are feeling a little strained by the movement. It's just to make the step a little smaller. And do one more. Turn 
back towards the center. Feet under the shoulders. Fold your hands over your lower abdomen. Feel your knees soft, tailbone sinking down, crown floating up. Just take a few deep abdominal breaths. Just transforming back from a crane into a human. And settling and gathering the energy we've cultivated at the lower Dantian. Good release. Very nice. Thank you for practicing.